so McKenna, your hope today, at some point in the future, is to be an RA. Yes. Now we have a patient here who seems elderly to me. Yes. Uh, what would we do with this patient? Well, generally we use it to practice for our clinicals and stuff. We use to like dress with a weak arm or partial bed baths. Now, how is it beginning to show signs of cyanosis? What is this about? He is having lack of oxygen, so he can't breathe. So just like anybody else, he's turning blue. What were his complaints when he was brought in here? He was having chest pain, and like he was having a heart attack. Now, something's going on inside of Howell's mouth. I'm sterile, so I'm going in to have a look. His teeth are perfect. He's obviously been to a local dentist, but something's up with his tongue. Mm -hmm. Well, it could be excitement over the cat of Hope and House that could be affecting. It could be a false reading. I see. So, like, maybe he's choking or can't get air to him. Well, let's let's see about the choking part of it. No, it, his airway feels good, but if, I feel he pulse, his pulses in the throat seem much more strong and intense than they were earlier. So now his pulse is really, really fast. So, well, that, that low reading on the blood pressure and the pulse seems to be false. It, it's picking up on us here, along with the cyanosis. Yeah, because his heart rate now is 156 when it was 75. Uh, Destiny, what are you going to be doing to Hal here? I'm going to be checking his blood pressure. Blood pressure, vital signs, okay. Does Hal ever talk to you while you're taking his blood pressure? No. No. And then so what's happening is over on this screen, the actual blood pressure is coming up, is that right? Yes, sir. And so here we see Hal's vital signs. Oh, that's not bad at all. 120 over 78, uh, heart rate of 75. Uh, Chase, what are you? Chase uh, we're still trying to figure out what's up with Hal. Are you going to take some pulses and yes, sir. weigh in on the diagnosis? Mm -hmm. Nothing like a group assessment here. Here we have a child patient. Looks like he has some sort of uh, neck injury, just like Hal. He's got great teeth. The eyes are smaller and tongue is nice. Now here we have a little bit more elevated heart rate uh, in the mid-80s. Blood pressure is, I don't know if we would consider that low, but he's got a slight fever. What's up with this patient, I wonder? On a child, their heart rate usually runs higher than an adult, adult, but the blood pressure should be a quite bit higher on him. We don't actually do it, though. I want my mom! Hey, bud, does your heart, does your neck hurt a little bit? A little bit. So, does your neck hurt a little bit? Does your neck hurt? On a scale of one to ten, how bad does it hurt? Seven. That's not good. So we've got some neck pain. It's a seven on a ten scale. He's, uh, I'm going to call it episodically blinking his eyes with one big blink. Now he's coughing. So what do you think, Doc? Actually, since we have the brace on him, he should be doing fine. Um, his throat might be swelling up just a little bit. His pulse is 68, and that's in normal range. So his pulse is normal range. We've got a blood pressure in normal range. Uh, and he has chest pain. I'm not sure what the diagnosis is. I'm no doctor, and I'm certainly no student at CADA, but I have a sense that there's something up with this guy's right leg. What's going on with Hal's right leg? I'm going to perform minor surgery here and peel this off. It looks like a bone. Whoa, something's up with Hal. I think Hal's having some sort of a seizure. Have you got a wallet? Can I have the wallet? we got to put this in Hal's mouth. Not really. <laughs> you got to have lotion um, and stuff? Yeah, you have to use a basin and you use rags and soap and water. That's it. And you use it and you go up underneath the nails and stuff and make sure they're clean and not dirty. Wow. And then we just use her 
mostly for clinical settings and like to go through for our state qual or not state for qualifications but like our for our actual CNA license we use her to practice and stuff for our tests that will be coming up. Now I talked to some buddies of mine who were at high school in Vimont they claim that she used her as a Christmas tree this year is that true? I don't think so. Okay. Well, that dispelled that rumor. And how about <laughs> dental care on her? She's got some very white teeth. Do you um, ever get into that, or is that generally really not we part use of it? it? We use each other. We practice on each other. It's easier to use with teeth, and then we have dentures that we use to practice for dentures. How about that? It's Thanks. pretty. Yeah, it's cool. It's pretty cool. Yeah.